Welcome to more uh, knowledge about virtual mic. This time I'm hoping to show you how um, a file can be converted into blocks. The model shown here on the screen is a beautiful little design by George Lingworth of Lancaster. Right, we have no blocks at the moment um, I am going to highlight that engine holding the shift key another engine, another engine, another engine. I am now going up to the top to model I think. Yes, model, move to block. Now I have no blocks at the moment so in here I'm going to type engine. Okay, right, don't worry yet, um, let's have a look at the top and we have an engine. So if we go in engine, there is our engine. So we revert back off this current block into default. There's the default and you'll notice the engine has gone. Now I will quickly select um, the parts that I want to associate with the engine. These are the mountings. Note that I have having no trouble in uh, selecting the items. Again now I'm going to move them on the model move to block engine. OK. And they've gone. Right, I think there's a couple of grub screws escaping here. There's one. There's another. Move to engine. Move to block engine. OK. Right. Let's quickly now, we have a base here. We'll call a stand. Um, and we'll go, select that. Select that. Select that. Select the rod. And underneath... A spring clip um, and that little grub screw and we're going to model move to block now we haven't got a base so we call it a base B A S E OK click off it let's go to base and we have the base there's the parts in the base um, we go to engine, we're looking, there's all the parts in the engine, look. Um, and there's default. Default, oh look, I've missed that bit off. That bit must be off the base. So I select that, and shift, hold, and model, move to block. Where's it going? It's going to the base, he says. Right, there we go. Right, we've got three ba three blocks left now, I reckon. It's, this is just to give you an idea. I'm now going to put the wings in a winged block. Here we go. One, two, three, four. I'm not going to keep counting. It's going to be annoying for you. There you go. Um, I don't know if I mentioned it earlier, but I've got a new graphic card and it makes selecting these items very easy. So I advise you, if you have an onboard graphic card and you're having problems selecting, get yourself a new graphics card. Oh dear, I've hit something and it's lost all me quickly I'm going to send them model move to block wings let's do it before we have another little accident here we go we'll look at the default there's your default so you want to select all these and put them in the wings Parts. 
move the block wings. I've been working with this program for eight years and others have also been working for a similar time. Move the block wings. And they still can't do blocks. So we're hoping now, after this video, you will be able to do it. Wings. OK. Right, so we've got two blocks left to go. Let's do a tail plane. That one, that one. Move model, move to black, type it in, tail plane. Okay, right, with the default, and what have we got left? There we go, we've got an odd bolt there. Part model, move to black, tail plane, okay, and all the rest. We've got another little spring clip there, that's off the... Off, where was it? The base, wasn't it? Move it to block base. There you go. Right, now what we can do is select in view... Oh dear, model, 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 model. Part, oh, can't find it now. It's gone quiet. Select all. It's under edit. There we go. We've got all them. That's the fuselage. This is going to be a big move. Move to block. Fuselage. If new S E L A G E. Fuselage. OK. Click the default. And we should have nothing left. Isn't it magic? Right. Now what we do, if we go to model, show all blocks, there's the model complete. So what we have, if we hold it in that position, you should be able to go to, using this little block box here, um, current block it's got, we've got a base. There's your base. Select the engine, there's the engine. Select the fuselage. Select the tailplane and select the wings. All right, and we can, if we go back up to model, show all blocks. There we are. Now I hope that. Don't forget that some of these. Um, this could be a, a real plane. Um, well, a real plane, a Meccano plane, but made. It, the wings could consist of hundreds of parts, and the fuselage could consist of a hundred parts. And to build it and show it in virtual mesh, it's much easier to have it in blocks. There you are. I hope you've learnt some more. Cheers for now. Bye.